Hey guys, what's up? Today I'm going to show you how to jailbreak iOS 6 Beta 1. Now this jailbreak is not for consumers, this is more for the developers because one of the big changes is you're not going to be able to get Cydia for this jailbreak, it's just going to give you root access and easier ways to like prepare for iOS 6. So obviously this isn't for everyone, but if you are running iOS 6 and want to play around with it, you can do this jailbreak, and I'll be showing you how to do that, do that right now. So the first thing you need to do is hit the extras button after opening Red Snow uh, 0.9.13 Dev 1. You can get this download, link in the description, open it up, and then come to the, this point in the video. So the first thing you're going to do is hit extras, and then you're going to hit uh, select IPSW. So this one you're going to select uh, the iOS 6 beta IPSW for your device. I'll be using my iPod Touch 4th generation. So just hit open, hit OK. And when you're done with that, you can click the back button. And now we're going to proceed to uh, the jailbreak tab. So just hit jailbreak and turn it on. Make sure your device is running iOS 6 like ours is. And then you can choose... Um, what things you want, I have install SSH and as it says right here, Cydia is not available so don't expect that and then we're going to hit next and now you're going to have to go into DFU mode so it says to turn off your device so I'll be turning my device off right now once your device is turned off you're going to hit next now you're going to go into DFU mode by following the instructions that are on the screen right there so that's what we're doing right now and then letting go and you can see right there it's jailbreaking the device so just wait for this to finish and on your device you get the downloading jailbreak did icon and your device should um, begin to jailbreak you see a lot of data going on and what you're going to need to do now is just to just boot so I'll go back and you're going to have to hit just boot but wait for the device to finish jailbreaking and turn back on because mine still says like installing bundle so we're just going to wait for that okay so now your device should be turned back on so you're just going to hit the just boot and same thing you're going to need to do again, turn off your device. And once you do that, you're going to proceed to DFU mode once again. So just hit next and then follow the instructions. And after this, your device should boot up and be working jailbroken. Now, again, note you're not going to see Cydia and the only thing that's really going to change is you're going to have root access to your device. So that's pretty much it. Once this finishes, you'll be done. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys later.